my chat. Oh, I hate my fucking hair. Do I have any hair grips left? No, for goodness sake. Oh, you prick. to my channel the daily wine so today we are going to be trying a pinot grigio i think i've left the bottle in the other room um i'm just giving you an update on life really because i've got nothing else to film perry is passed out in bed next to me there he is he went on a pub crawl today and i got home and he's passed out like this he's been sick he's had face paint on i don't know what's going on so yeah i'm just gonna crop him out like that I've been at work for 11 hours, so I look minging, I feel minging, haven't even had dinner yet, but have nothing else to post, so I need to edit it and get it posted by tomorrow before I'm at work again for another 11 hours. So I'm very, very tired, so I'm going to try and whiz, whiz through this. So, the wine that I'm drinking today, hold tight. bottle of Pinot Grigio. It's from La Rocca Grande de la Terre Alte. I don't know. Siri Oro. White series maybe that means? Dolce Grande, Tradizione, Vinixola, Italiana, Nascono, Vini, Che Espimono, Imerioni, Anca or something. I don't know. It's Italian. It's Pinot Grigio. Geographica Tipica. So it's Tipica wine again. Um, it says serve at 8 to 10 degrees. I know that pesky is fish and crustacei is crustacean. So with like seafood and fish I think it means serve. Um, I just got it from the corner shop to be honest. I had to go and pick something up for dinner. And I was like, you know what? Let's do the wine. I've got to film a video. I Basically, I can never let myself not film a video or have a video for the day that I'm supposed to do it or the day after. Because otherwise I'll not do it. I just won't, won't do it. If I didn't have film now... I wouldn't post a video Sunday, I'll never post again. Like, it's weird OCD in my head, but now I've started. Like, if I stop one weekend, I'll never do it again. You might as well sell my stuff. So, yeah, I just get to post a filler video, which is great. This smells, oh, very strong, actually. It's 12%, so that's nice. And got it on my nose now. Smells nice, smells like white wine. I'm really not impressed, I'm really tired, but it does smell really, really nice. 12%, don't feed to pregnant people. That's a general gist, let's do the tasting. That's a general gist, let's do the tasting. Cheers! I don't usually like Pinot, but for a Pinot that is quite pleasant. Ugh, weird aftertaste though. Tastes like... It's as if I've just put cardboard or a napkin in my mouth is the aftertaste. Mm. Yeah, it's not the best, it's not the last. Uh, what would I give this out of 10? Mm. Yeah, it's fine. It doesn't uh, taste as good as it smells, and the actual mouthfuls that you have are nicer than the aftertaste. The aftertaste brings it right down. It's quite nice. No heartburning feeling, really. It's a little bit warm, but it's not too bad. If anyone, if, does anyone even get that? It's just what I think. I don't know if that happens to anyone else, so I haven't contoured my face either, so my face just looks so round. Oh my god, I look a mess. What would I rate this out of 10? I would probably rate this a 7 out of 10. It's quite nice. I don't like the aftertaste, but it's very, very sweet, which is surprising to me for a Pinot, but it's fine. Cheers. Let's move on. So, life update. Don't want to take too long. Life's going okay. Still feel sad sometimes. You know, for no reason. Is what it is. I am... Um, what was I going to say? I've spent so much money this month on drinking. I'm truly, truly fed up of it. Like, I'm so glad I didn't join Perry on the bar crawl because I just could not have done it. I spent an obscene amount. Absolutely obscene amount when I went out last weekend because I went on an all-day pub crawl. Um, disgusting. 
absolutely disgusting. I wish I'd gone with Perry. He went to watch Eurovision at our friend's house and do like drinking Eurovision. Wish I'd done that instead. No. Pub crawl. So every pub, spend money. Doing rounds that cost £30 each. Why? What's the point? Especially when I'm meant to be using it for bills and other things. So now I'm really poor. But I was very good earlier. I was going to order fried chicken. And then thought, you know what, you can cook at home. So currently my food is cooking so that whilst I'm eating dinner, I can edit my video. Yeah, watch the Friends reunion yesterday. Gonna post a Friends for Theme video next week, I think. Absolutely sobbed my heart out. It was a lot to take in. Like, this is my whole life growing up. Oh, from like the age of six or something. Um, something mad, just like yeah and then just I was flooding with tears the whole time it's so emotional seeing everyone like say goodbye like that's the last time you're ever gonna see them together probably how sad how sad is that I, like my heart can't take it um and when they're all hugging and just like saying like it was their best years and their final scenes of the films and stuff and I'm just like whoa let's take it easy this is meant to be light and breezy and it's not feeling light and breezy it's feeling very depressing at the minute so yeah cry my eyes out at that um season two of Lucifer has gone on today not season two Season 5 of Lucifer has gone on today. I need to start watching it immediately. Um, I, to the point where I even checked it at midnight to see if it, the episodes have gone on. Lucifer is one of the most incredible shows in the world. Obviously, it's about the devil. But he comes to Earth. He's like... He's just like, yeah, I'm here. I'm in Earth. It's amazing. It's really, really good. And I'm so, I've been so buzzing for the new episodes. Well, I've literally been counting down the days since they last said they were going to put the episodes on since they gave us a date. So yeah, I can't wait to finish watching season five. Don't know whether to carry on from the beginning though, because I, I have started watching them from season one again. I don't know if that's going to take too much time and I'm going to see some spoilers, so I don't really want to do that. Finish watching Working Mums on Netflix. These are all things that I watch like in the bath and before I go to bed because I don't have time any other time to watch them. Working Mums is really good as well. Um, some weird things in there and some like, there was a thing so shocking. I've never been so shocked by a plot twist in my entire life. Like I was just out there like, anyone else would have guessed it but it shocked me to my core I was like whoa I hate all men I don't know pretty meninists out there um anything else sorry baby state of that honestly uh I want to start reading again and I want to sell pictures of my feet on the internet for money so if anyone knows any buyers of those pictures of my feet they're, they're not nice, I'll tell you that now. Then, like, I've got one nice foot. That's it. But if anyone knows of anyone that's got, like, a little foot fetish and will pay good money to see feet in tights or feet in shoes, let me know. Because I'll actually do it. I need the money. I'm never going to. No. Because I'll actually do it. Because why not, you know? Why wouldn't I? Ah, uh, trying to think of what else. Oh, no. I'm really, really tired. I haven't seen my family too much the past few weeks, so I feel sad about that. Just been really, really busy. I really want to start seeing them more often. I try to like when I when I look after the dog on my day off, but I don't get to see him very much at all. So I'd like to see that. And yeah, just tired really. Just need some sleep. <laughs> um, I don't really have anything else to say. Training new people at work, really fun, they're really, really nice. I say that like sounding completely unenthused. They are amazing and they're really lovely. I'm just like so tired. But yeah. Uh, officially deleted the house searching app off my phone because it's just making me depressed every time I log on and there are no houses. So, Or like none that I could afford because I live in a disgustingly expensive part of the country where one flat costs half a mil. So yay. Yeah, that's all I really have to say this week, guys. I really just wanted to do a wine tasting and a quick chat. Something that I can edit easy because I, I really need to eat and go to bed because I've got work again in the morning. So I need to just eat and chill. But I just thought I'd do one to keep up with my streak and just to let you know about the wine. I would actually buy that wine if I was someone else. If you like Pinot, you'll love that wine. I just wasn't keen on the after aftertaste, but that's it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Have a lovely day. Stay safe. And remember, all for wine, wine for all. Peace.
Oh yeah, and also I fell off a ladder this week, so my arm is killing me. My whole body feels like it's been hit by a bus, so I don't even know if you can see it. I don't bruise easy either, and my whole arm is scratched. This whole part of my arm is sensitive and sore and bruised, and my knees are bruised, and my I stabbed myself, I fell with scissors in my hand, stabbed myself in the ear with scissors, ear bled, still scabby now. Yeah, it's been a rough week, guys. Please wish me luck in my quest to not die. Love you all. Bye.